I just noticed you're sniffing. Smell something pleasant? I smell something, but it isn't pleasant. What is that? Oh, I'm so glad you asked. I'm marketing my new fragrance, Essence of Addy. Essence of Addy? Who's gonna want that? You're just jealous because you're not marketing your own fragrance. <laughs> oh no, I dropped my fragrance. What was that? I'll go to the window. What is it? Aw, oh, Jillian, there's a big monkey out there! How big are we talking? Like, real big. Like, King Kong big. Wait, so you're saying King Kong's out there? Come see for yourself. I'll go to the window. Okay, okay, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. Yeah, I bet King Kong chooses lots of suburban neighborhoods to rampage in. He's probably just on his way to somewhere else, like, I don't know, Kong Island. Yeah, what are the odds he'd pick out our house to squish with his gigantic feet? Ah, uh, he's gonna squish our house with his gigantic feet! I told you this would happen, I told you, but no, you didn't listen to me. You didn't tell me anything. Why are you putting this on me? I don't know. I gotta blame someone. Well, maybe instead of blaming me, you should do something about the fact that King Kong is on our house. You know what? I have an idea. Does the idea result in King Kong getting off of our house? What? No, I was just gonna get ice cream until this blows over. Jillian, if you step outside, that monkey's gonna grab you up and eat you. He wouldn't do that. Does he do that? Nah, he wouldn't. If only we had some kind of shrink ray to reduce him to a harmless size. You mean like this? You're telling me you've had a shrink ray this whole time? Well, this is the first time that King Kong was on our house. You really think that's gonna shrink that giant monkey? Of course I do. It even has a King Kong setting. All right, fire it up. All right, now let's see. Jillian, it just looks like a lamp. Addy, what part of don't you understand? You sound like a dog in pain. Hey, hey, Addy. What? Do you hear King Kong anymore? No, I don't. Are you telling me that shrink ray worked? Yes, obviously. Well, what happened to him? Now that he's only two meters tall, a bird will just eat him. You mean two millimeters tall, right? Not millimeters, Addy. A millimeter is a thousand meters. We don't want to make him bigger. Jillian, a millimeter is a thousandth of a meter. Are you telling me you made King Kong two meters tall? Well, yeah, but... Two meters is still better than two thousand meters, right? Jillian, two meters is over six feet tall. Now we can just get into the house instead of crushing it. Well, he'd have to get off the roof first. He's a monkey. He can climb. It sounds more like he's scurrying than climbing. Quick, shrink him the rest of the way and then we can, I don't know, flush him down the toilet or something. I think I burned it out. It's only good for one shrinking. All right, all right, we're not gonna panic. We should be fine as long as he doesn't get into the house. <laughs> ah, shrunken King Kong got into the house. Well, I guess the least we can do is at least close this door. Aw, King Kong's all little now. Um, you can go now. It definitely wasn't us that shrunk you down. <laughs> ah! He knew we were lying! Well, you sure did it this time, Jillian. You had to go and shrink him. And I just wanted to get ice cream. 
All right, there's two of us and one of him. Let's just go beat the snot out of him. I don't think it's that simple. Come on, you and I used to beat up gorillas all the time back in our wild days. No, we didn't. Anyway, he still retains all of his Kong strength. So wait, despite being only two meters tall, he's just as strong as ever? Yup, and every bit as bloodthirsty. So I guess it's not like we can just lure him away with a banana or something. He's still got a super appetite. You'd need a one-ton banana. One-ton banana? You'd need a one-ton banana. We're not getting into any copyrighted music here. Well, maybe all we need to do is convince him that this is a one-ton banana. You mean you'd lie about the weight of that banana just to get rid of a miniaturized King Kong? You don't know what I'm capable of. Let's just give the big monkey the banana. <laughs> King Kong, we've realized we've been terrible hosts. Perhaps you're hungry. <laughs> and definitely not hungry for, like, human. Banana. Great, he didn't leave and we lost one of our valuable bananas. Ooh, I'll make him some banana bread. We're out of bananas. What we need is a non-banana based solution. Yeah, like pineapples. We're not doing fruit. Aww. You've seen the King Kong movies? What scares this guy? How do they defeat him? He climbs up the Empire State Building, and then you get a bunch of airplanes, and you shoot him until he falls off. For multiple, multiple reasons. That's not gonna work. Whew, for a second there, I thought you were gonna ask me to build the Empire State Building. Wait, airplanes. That gives me an idea. Airplanes? We don't have airplanes. We have something even better. Imagination. All right, King Kong, you know what these are? Airplanes, your biggest fear. I think he's gonna make us actually throw them. Well, then we're gonna actually throw them. All right, Kong, here it comes. Oh, they just bounced off of him like paper off of a gorilla. He wasn't even impressed with those planes. Do you think he'll give them back? No, they went the way of the banana. Well, bananas, paper airplanes, I'm all out of ideas. Why did he have to pick on our house? What possibly could have attracted him here? Addy, what did you make that essence of Addy out of? How dare you blame my essence of Addy? It's monkey pee, isn't it? <sighs> yeah. Well, no wonder we have a miniaturized King Kong out in our hallway. Hey, the miniaturized part was totally your fault. I guess we just need to calmly accept our fate. Anything else from the King Kong movie that we can use? At the end, they say it was beauty killed the beast. That's a weird way of saying it. Why didn't they just say it was beauty that killed the beast? Are they trying to be poetic in a King Kong movie? Beauty, eh? We're both gonna need makeovers. I'm beautiful as I am, and not just for Kong. Wait, I have a better idea. Oh, I'm just so beautiful. Oh, I sure hope no King Kongs comes and takes me away. Oh no! He's gone! Wait, this actually worked? Well, Addy, I hope you've learned your lesson. Yeah, from now on, no more essence of Addy. What was that? 
You know what, I did have a backup fragrance called Eau de Addy. Well, let's go to the window. Back to the drawing board. Oh no. Merchy, merchy, merch, merch, merchy, merchy, merch, merchy, merchy, merch, merch, merchy, merchy, merch, merchy, merchy, merch. Hey! If you like Jillian and Addy videos, you're gonna love our merch. With a wide variety of products and designs, there's something for everyone. Just click on the links below and they'll take you to our Spring store. Or just go to JillianandAddy.com. It's all good. So that was King Kong on our house. If you like this video, be sure to give a big thumbs up and subscribe. Be sure to check out our other two channels. There's Jillian and Addy, our main channel, and Jillian and Addy Life, our vlogging channel. They're a ton of fun. Tell us what you thought about this video on Instagram. We, all post it. we also post new pictures, videos, and stories post every day. We even post sneak previews of our upcoming videos, like this one. And remember, stay scared. Bye. Bye. So Jillian's just after rolling out. Oh, your head came off. Ah. Uh. <laughs> that looks awfully familiar.